Police chief in Minneapolis admitted that his department failed to protect a man who long feared for his safety. That man is now hospitalized after he was allegedly shot by his neighbor. Laura Geary tells us there's now a public outcry that officers should have done something sooner. And we want to warn you, some video in this story is disturbing. Hey. Try it again then, tough guy. Stay away. Minneapolis resident Davis Maturi has taken many videos like this of his neighbor John Sawcheck since late 2023. He's called police at least 19 times, detailing threats and harassment, according to local news affiliate CARE. Last week, police say that escalated to gunfire. The bullet like went down um, through my neck and then all the way back to my spine. We failed this victim 100%. Minneapolis Police Chief Brian O'Hara says his department had been trying to arrest Sawchuck for at least six months and had been surveilling him 24-7 since warrants were issued for last Wednesday's shooting of Matori, adding that Sawchuck has known mental health issues, was likely armed, and that the police department is severely understaffed. We have been trying to get this person into custody safely, which would mean getting him outside of the house when he is not near guns or any other weapon. Sunday evening, police stopped waiting. CARE reports that a SWAT team and special tactics unit used a battering ram to break out windows of Sawcheck's home after several hours of negotiations failed. Sawcheck finally surrendered in the early hours Monday and was taken into custody. CARE says he faces several charges, including attempted murder, stalking, and harassment. An outcome, after a cautious approach, that Maturi says should have come much sooner. You have this body armor. You have the professional training. If you're saying you're scared, what does that do to me? I'm Laura Aguirre reporting.